Ni hao! Welcome back! In this video, we are going to compare those ambiguous words in Chinese grammar. For today, we are taking a look on the adverbs di chue and chue shi. They are often translated as indeed, really, or truly. Both of them can be used interchangeably. However, when it is act as an adjective, we can only use the chue shi. Examples. 这的确不简单。这的确不简单。这的确不简单. This is not easy indeed. 我的确受不了了。我的确受不了了。I really can't stand it anymore. 我们的确不知道。我们的确不知道。We really don't know. As you may notice, all these three sentences are acting as an adverb. So for this, we can actually replace it with 确实. For example, 这的确不简单 can be rephrased to 这确实不简单 我的确受不了了 can be changed to 我确实受不了了。我们的确不知道。我们确实不知道。However, when we are using them as an adjective, we can only use the word 确实 in a sentence. For example, 这件事确实吗? 这件事确实吗? Is this matter real? 这是确实的证据吗? 这是确实的证据吗? Is this evidence true? Or you can say, is this evidence real? 这是确实的,不是假的。这是确实的,不是假的。This is true, not fake. All these three sentences represent the meaning real. To sum up, the adverbs 的确 and 确实 can be used interchangeably. However, when we are going to use it to represent the meaning real, we can only use the word 确实, as in 这是确实的,不是假的. Therefore, if we change it to 这是的确的,不是假的, this is going to be a wrong sentence. That's all for today. See you in the next video.